Hi Sagittarius, welcome to my channel. This reading for today, Sagittarius, this is a collective tarot reading session for you, Sagittarius. I hope you are well. I hope you're fine and safe and doing good. This reading for today, this is for the Sagittarius sign. Let us see what is coming towards you guys. What is the guided message that is meant for you to know and ready for you to know? This is for the sign of Sagittarius, okay? Thank you guys for your support. Thank you guys for being here. If you would like to further connect with me, Sagittarius, you know what to do. All of the details is down in the description box below. This is a collective reading for the Sagittarius sign, please. What can I get for the Sagittarius sign, please? We will pick up love, money, career, and general situation. You're ready to fall in love, Sagittarius. You are so ready to fall in love. You've got the Queen of Cups. Let's see what's coming up. What's what's connecting towards you? Okay, you've got the Queen of Cups. You've got the Chariot card. Let me just shuffle this again. You have the Queen of Cups. You have the Queen of Pentacles. You've got the Page of Swords. You've got the King of Cups. Wow, this is like a... You know, this is like... This reading is... Up until... Wow. Okay. Alright, let's start your reading. You've got the Taurus card in here. Seven of Pentacles. You've got the Wheel of Fortune. Okay, let's start your reading. You have a Queen of Cups in here. I feel like this is you. If you look at the Queen of Cups, Sagittarius, it looks like you're ready, but you don't want to share your cup. Look at you. Okay. So, Queen of Cups, I want you to be prepared. Prepare, because... I really feel like you've done all of your shadow work, you know, if you look at the Queen of Cups. She's surrounded by little babies, okay? There's babies in here, babies, babies in here. So it means that you have done your shadow work. You have, you know, maybe for some of you guys, you have, um, you've got this past life trauma, inner child trauma, which is one of the most difficult to heal because it's connected to your family, to the upbringing, to hardship, I would say you really step into embracing, okay? You have embraced that past and you have healed it. You've done your shadow, you know? It's not perfect, but I can really feel that you want to stay positive, optimistic, and you have embraced your past and that past made you who you are right now. And you're very proud of that. You're very proud of your battle scars. Those people who disappoint you, maybe betrayed you, you're seeing that as a learnings, okay? So I would say you're good. You know, you're not hateful. You're simply waiting for the right person to, you know, new friends, new adventure, new experience, new person. Or you're waiting for your apple of the eye to improve. Now, unconsciously, you healed yourself, okay? Unconsciously, you know, sometimes, sometimes it takes another person to tell us that, hey, you know what, you're very defensive. Or, you know what, you're, you're like this. You're acting like this. So this is the kind of vibe I'm picking up today, Sagittarius, is that you have healed the biggest part of you which has been betrayed or disappointed but then you're acting defensive your your healing process it's almost complete but you are scared to share your cup and how will you know like your healing process will be completed if you will not trust yourself to be vulnerable you know in short you're whole again you are you know, well sometimes when you healed yourself you work towards healing yourself and then you wanted to connect it's still there's still a little bit of hold back coming from you to let go of the guard 
can allow people to connect with you because you're still somehow you want to love but you're protecting the cup in here don't be afraid don't be scared because you have healed you have embraced the process you've learned a lot so trust your choices okay your choices will take you to a breakthrough so in the next three seven ten days you will have a page of pentacles this is a person in the past okay that probably contributed to some of your disappointment but they have moved on and you have moved on they're quite scared they're quite scared it could be a friend it could be a lover but it will happen very fast um the universe really felt like you're ready to fall in love you're ready to make amends to someone you had a misunderstanding in the past you know even if they don't ask for forgiveness you've let go of it i really feel that so now to test that you're completely ready to fall in love to connect you've got to let them in okay um the chariot card yeah ace of cups wow look at that you know this chariot card this is this speaks to me as when you're really ready to open up the universe will immediately fast send you someone for you okay so in the next three seven ten days there is a new love it it looks like a renewed chapter but it's still coming from the past it could be it could be a friend it could be it's someone you know in the past that has I would say contributed to those disappointment. Um, they want an Ace of Cups, Sagittarius. They want an Ace of Cups. Yeah, it could be overseas. They want an Ace of Cups. It could be overseas. Like this person, they're quite scared because you. You know what I'm hearing is that you're unreachable. It's possible you block this person. They're, they're going to find. It's possible that you. The world card represents that they have moved on. And they're hoping and wishing that you also have moved on. If you look at the world card in here. Look at that. Stubborn. Roar. Lion. And the bull. This is you and this person could be love and hate relationship. Or cat and mouse but it could it's a special person it could be a friend it could be a lover could be a relative it's not connected to work but it's a person who slowly if you look at their step look at look at the way they send you the message look at their step they're not they're they're nervous and they're slowly walking towards you look at their step so they're like this person is actually wish wishing or when they were typing the message to you, they were actually telling themselves, like, I wish I'm not rejected. I wish this message would go through because they felt like you are unreachable. Yeah, Six of Pentacles. I really hope that they will compose a very nice message. Six of Pentacles. You know, whoever this person is, they will really nice they will really write a very nice message. They will tell you, in the spirit of our friendship, could you, could I talk to you? Could could we have a conversation? Um, I've been thinking about you lately. It feels very serious, Sagittarius. Yeah, like one, once you, it could also be like um, a younger sibling or someone overseas as well. They have recently had a haircut if you follow them in social media they had a change of look haircut okay so they're very serious they're very polite they're very diplomatic it's there's nothing weird or awkward in the way they send the message not hi Sagittarius not like that the vibe is really respectful with boundaries like I've been thinking about you and you will feel that there is something they will send it in a day in a time where like they will send a message in a day in a time where you will you're in a good mood you look at that you're in a good mood this is you you look very spiritual you look like you've meditated yoga but you look very peaceful 
you look like um, you really work towards your shadow uh, side. You know those, lately, I want to share with you Sagittarius because I'm so close to your energy. You know, lately, I had a catch up with my coach. Uh, I have a, a coach and a spiritual coach. So every month we will gather. And um, so I had a catch up with them. And this is really interesting that what makes you angry or upset is actually an opportunity because your intuition is protecting you it's our reaction to 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 that being angry that we need to control you know if someone upset you if you're impulsive you rare so but then that feeling of being angry or mad or disappointed it's actually our intuition protecting us that this person is doing something that makes you feel bad our reaction towards feeling bad angry that is all we need to control so you i would say you've done the work for that you know this person disappointed you or upset you i mean so be it i mean look at you you even look young if you notice the less angry here you are <laughs> the more peaceful and young you look yeah look at you so peaceful baby face look at that so you will receive their message Look at you. You're holding the coins. You're thinking. You're feeling. You don't... I'm kind of picking up that you don't want to respond to them upset. You don't want to allow being upset, being angry towards this person. Okay? This Their message towards you, although they need you, you know, if I always find that a person from the past, when they come back to us, it's all it's always about them. It's not about us. So you, you know that their message towards you, it's because they want to connect. And they want something from you. And that is a connection. You, because you're doing your shadow work, you're, you're connected to your intuition. You're connected to your higher self, to your spirit, you know, to that energy, to that being, to that spirit inside of you. You're connected to that. And if you're connected to that, you're connected to your higher power. Okay. So the way you handling this is that you receive the message. You don't want to upset yourself. You don't want to remember how they have upset you or hurt you. You just receive the message. You're thinking, thinking, and feeling. This reading tells me you don't even want to be upset. Like being upset or angry. You don't want to put that in that baby face. Look at you look at you look look at how beautiful you are your aura you look like a baby you're very charming if you're a if you're a female you're embracing that inner goddess in you the feminine side if you're a male you're embracing the champion the alpha in you you're calm you know you're calm and masculine you don't unleash your masculinity that alpha inside of you for for anger you for the feminine you don't want to reply and use your femininity the goddess inside of you to be upset to be angry you're fully in control i love it i love you Sagittarius. oh wow look at that soulmate because you're attracting soulmate connection you're attracting the spiritual connection told you there's something unique about you today now i can't put this because youtube is censoring me because they're saying that this is porn you know so let's not um but this is the lover's card i cannot auto focus it because they're making they're i don't know i'm bad but yeah there's some problem with our analytics technology nowadays is so intelligent that they they see naked men and women they they didn't they don't identify that this is earth because technology has no soul but if you look at that yeah it's naked but it's artful it's full of art you know so yeah dum 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 anyway okay so i see you replying page of swords look at that i see you reply you will reply nice ten of cups you know they will say sorry to you. You know, Ten of Cups. Look at that. This person will probably say sorry to you in the spirit of our friendship, of our family, 
of our mother, of our father, of our relationship. Can I talk to you? I'm really, really sorry. Something like that. You feel peaceful. I don't know, but there is peace in you. Um, Page of Swords, you will reply. Your reply to them will make them feel more and more attracted to you. I think you would say apology accepted, something like that. Page of Swords. Like it's Page of Swords, this is straightforward, logical. Whatever your reply is, it's logical and straightforward. No drama. You're just simply replying to a message. No anger, no drama. Because you're protecting yourself. Like it's more of, I don't want to be mad because I'm so beautiful. I'm so pretty. Look at that. You look like an angel. Isn't it nice? Okay. So the love for yourself, for your, whatever you work on is protecting you. So you will reply. I see you replying. Look at them. King of Cups. The more they are attracted to you. When you reply, straightforward, no drama. It could be like, apology accepted. I am good. Now, they will reply. They, You will make them fall in love. Or they will they will be stepping into their power they will be stepping into they will be stepping into their emotions because they're scared this is pentacle pentacles pentacles this is action and effort now from the page they will switch to the king it means that this is where they will prepare to connect with you emotionally and show you their loyalty like this is their chance once you reply with this person, it felt like I have a chance with Sagittarius. I need to be better. I need to be the king of cups. You have unleashed them. It feels like you, your reply, your message to them, you just invited them. Yeah. Page of cups. So from the page of pentacles, they will message you with a page of cups. So the next series of message communication, step forward could be a lover you know love interest it would be emotionally connected to you it will be raw it will be not dramatic but it would be raw it's peaceful it's offering you a lot of love Sagittarius it's committed to offer you love friendship relationship that is secure um, a relationship that you deserve they're willing to work hard. They're, they're willing to be your gardener. Seven of Pentacles. They're willing to in, invest a lot of time and effort to make it work for you because you deserve it. You know it's a reading. And then everything fall into places. Look at that. This is beautiful. It could be a friend. It could be a lover. But it's someone who you work so hard to forget them and forget being angry. And here they are. They felt that you're ready. They felt that you're such a good person to let them in or to give them a chance. And they will never disappoint you. They're committed to show, to, like they're committed to show you, Sag, that they're meant to stay. They're, they're committed to show you the rawness of, and seriousness of what they really want from you. Yeah. Hangman, you just wait because it will fall into places. Let them do all the work. Yeah, three of pentacles work. Very peaceful. Yeah, page of wands. All of the pages, baby step. They message you. They say sorry. They're awakened. And page of wands, this is the real action, the fun side, the flirting side, the reconnecting side. You know, this is the actual fun. So it's a little bit dramatic in the beginning. A little bit, just a little bit. But it will fall into places you will enjoy. The renewed partnership or renewed love relationship thing, okay? This reading for today is valid three to six months. Yep. You know what? Sometimes you guys can wake me up. You know how you do that? Imagine you guys are 30,000 subscribers. And if you guys, we are all, we have atoms, energy inside of us. <clears throat> Sometimes I could feel like I need to do a reading. Because 
imagine you guys are 30,000. And if you simultaneously all together think of me, you can really make me wake up. So if you feel like, okay, I'm resonating to this video, keep the link. Keep the link. Play it. Play it. Play it. If you're resonating. That's why for some of you guys, I don't know why I get... Anyhow, this is peaceful. <laughs> Let's be peaceful. <laughs> Sag, um, this is a reading. This is your reading. Thank you so much. Let's be positive for today. I love your reading. I don't want to spoil it. But it looks fun. This this is this is beautiful. This is a very beautiful transition. So keep on going. Keep on connecting to your higher self, Sagittarius. Thank you for connecting with me. Thank you for spending day with me. Um, for private reading and for our merchandise, everything is processed in the website. And um, thank you for shouting me a coffee. Thank you for the love notes. Don't worry, guys. Those who send me a a buy buy me a coffee and write me a love notes i am responding to all of you so i'm excited to write back to you all thank you guys and i will connect with you soon you have a great day bye bye